Okay, now if Saul, for whom name is Paul, who changed his name to Paul, rather, or say Jesus from heaven changed his name to Paul, whatever, which one ever you want to believe, but his name was actually Saul. This according to scripture, he changed his name. Okay, now in his conversion, right? Because I'm saying even if even if God, Jesus converted him, in his new understanding, this is what I'm trying to tell people about mental currency, right? So he, if, if before he believed, right, in money, then after he believed, he was converted, this is what he said about money. This is what I'm telling you all about when I saw, uh, when I made money, then I was taken to its root, its or origination, like, what it's all about and i was able to see it because i had the mental currency necessary okay now this is first timothy 6 verse 10 uh, the king james version it says for the love of money is the root of all evil which while some converted after they have erred from the faith and pierced themselves through with many sorrows. I mean, excuse me, covered it, excuse me, covered it. So now when I do that, I, I look it up. So covered it, we're going to look up covered it. Now this is, this is just what I do for punishing myself for making them, you know. So I, I say, well, maybe... I have to, uh, you know, maybe I have to look it up to be more thorough. See, and that's the thing about being in a in a mental battle, man. You know, you you gotta, okay, covered it, earnestly wished for or sought after. So, see, when you covet money, right? Then it says right here in the scripture, right? He's telling you. What I saw, that's why I'm agreeing with this. You know how the Bible says, if two or more agree. See, he's saying, for the love of money is the root of all evil. Now, how about if he said this? For the love of money in the civil and criminal courthouses in Seminole and Orange Counties in the state of Florida is the root of all evil on August 12, 2008 at 1040 in the morning. See what I'm saying? See, then would you believe it? Now, then would that be a prophecy, right? But how can somebody yesterday be as thorough as I am today? Because I'm seeing what he saw. See, but Jesus didn't convert me. You see what I'm saying? Like when I made this money to take care of my wife and my children, the devil converted me. See what I'm saying? And that's why I was saying converted because I'm telling my testimony and then it said covenant. But that's what I'm telling people. Like I'm saying, listen, man, I'm reading this, but I'm also thinking about what I'm saying. And sometimes it flood together because I'm at the, I'm at the edge of insanity, man. Like I got to sit here and try to get people to help me every day my life going by, right? And somebody's telling me about how to make money. And I'm saying, okay, well, let's do this. And they say, oh, no, man. Hey, man, let's invest in this. Oh, no. I'm saying, well, that's how I made the money. So you just want me to tell you how I made money so you can leave me struggling, man? See, that's what I'm saying. For 15 years, I'm seeing people who wasn't making money when I was making money, now I got all this money. And I'm saying, so are you making the money off of me? So let me show you how to make more money. But then they don't want to make no money with me. But they want me to keep telling them how I made money. And I'm saying, so are you making money? But what about the provisions? See, I made money, but I, I turned that money into knowledge. See? See, so I don't need money no more. I just need people to have the knowledge of the knowledge, right? So if you have knowledge of the knowledge, 
then you will want to purchase the knowledge that I have acquired. See what I'm saying? But see, if you still in the knowledge, then see, that's why we are now, see, which while some coveted after, see? So now let's go back to coveted. See what I'm saying? So this is what I'm saying. See, I'm breaking it down so you will understand what Saul talking about even when he changed his name to Paul. See what I'm saying? So that is earnestly wished for a sought after. So see, now instead of the person coming to get the knowledge, they wanted to steal the rights to the book. And I'm saying, well then, are you going to ever let the people have the knowledge that you stole the rights to the book? See, and that's what the high priest Caiaphas them did, right? They killed Jesus. And then they then told the story. See, now they selling the story to you. And I'm, and the Bible is telling you that they actually saw. See, you are descending of Saul. See, just like if you are descendant of Jesus, you got to believe Mary, that Mary never know the man. See, you got to believe that. So you got to believe Mary.